Alright, in today's video, you all, we're going to open up some boxes. Hey, the Chuck in the box. No, not that kind of box. Gee, Williker, stop joking around. We're going to go back to previous video and open up some kit boxes that I got from my model car collection. This video is going to be about... I'm going to show you guys all of the things that I've purchased. So check out today's video and we'll come back at the end and say cheers. Okay, after a day of charging the battery up, one day later, we're going to go through the rest of the stash collection. So anyhow, da -da 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 -da, we got the Mike Skinner car. Let's see what's in there. And you know what? Uh, the bad thing is, there's less light today. It's dreary and the rain's coming back, so that's so maybe the camera won't come in clear. So the Skinner car looks complete. I'm not too worried if it's com uh, missing some stuff, but you know what? Everything is here. Look at this. Wow. Decals, Mike Skinner, Lowe's decals. So that is a good thing. It's all complete. So there's another chassis, waiting for a chassis, hot rod chassis, that's what we're waiting for. Uh, let's move on, you know what, while we're here let's just see if Circle Track Rusty Car has, uh, you know, 27 was my favorite number back in the day. Sorry, I'm going to use you guys to uh, my hand, my video camera hand, to lift this up. But uh, 27 was my favorite number and number 2 because those were the two numbers that Rusty used and I would play those in my lottery, number 2 and number 27. Uh, chrome rims, small parts tree, chrome, looks good. Everything is there except for wheels. No, nope, wheels are there actually. So wow, complete kit. So between these three NASCAR kits, that was $45 for me. I was happy with that. So one, two, three. So one, two, the gasser's not included. Three, four, five, six, seven. So I got seven kits to me for five bucks. That's how I look at it. So let's go. How about the 55 Chevy first? The gasser. You know, I wonder how much is in there. If it's complete, if I can rebuild it. Oh, you know what? Let's come back to that. I thought the 55 was in here. That is a huge collection. I need uh, better lighting on that situation. Build the... So let's check out what's in this box. Oh my god, look at that. There we go. Wow! This was done up in the Ford Motocraft livery, livery, whatever you want to call it. Look at this. It's not... The Pro Street Bird, it's the Pro Stock Bird. Another extra engine, boss engine, extra chassis. Oh yeah. Or who knows, we can do a field fine, barn fine car. Oh yeah, look at this. Oh my god. The Pontiac. It's the... I can't tell. It's a big block? Yeah, it's a big block. Tub chassis again. No rear end. Here's the rear end laying in there. No, that's the front uh, rack and pinion. It's got the hood. It's got the bumper. You know what? I've always wanted this car. Oh, here's the hood. Got lots of hood scoops and parts for this. Oh my god, look at this. All it needs is a rear end. And I'm sure it has a rear end and I got extra tires. This is a bonus. Look at this. You got the drag stars, pro stars. Here's the rear axle. Oh, I, I like this. See, there's a pro street build going on right now. And unfortunately, I don't have time to do it. But I would join the pro street build with this body. And change it from... Uh, oh, so the taillights don't look too good. I would change it from pro stock to pro street. Hoods there. Extra tires, look at this. These two tires, I like these. These are good for a 125th kit because they're small tire. 
And look at, I got extra weld wheels. I got extra drag stars. Wow, look at how many drag stars I got. And welds. One, two, three. Look at this. Shh. Oh, there's more. Look at how many drag stars can a guy have? That one, that one, that one. Weld. Oh, this is a dream for me. Look at carb. Really nice carb. Wow. Oh, the Chevelle bumper. Painted green. Ugly green. So this was a bonus. This is a super bonus. I don't care what shape it's in. To me, it's a bonus. We can do something with that. So let's move that out of the way. And go on to... Then what is in this Pro Street Bird Box? I have no clue. It's, uh, sorry, I'm holding the camera again. You get to see a close-up shot of, oh, come on, of course it's sticking and I can't use my little fingers to get it open. Ah, oh, come, and then I, ah, uh, come on. Can I, can I curse now? Wow, this one's really giving me trouble. I apologize for the bad camera work, but hey, like I say, substandard videos. Oh! There's no T-Bird in this. Whoops, I'm losing parts. What did I lose? Uh, air cleaner? I don't know. Somebody was going to tub out a 66 Chevy 2. Here's the back half. You know what, my friend? You, they already have a Chevy 2 kit that's tubbed out. So there's a lot of extra tubs. If you ever build a tub car, you can put all of this stuff together. Frame rails. Some more extra tubs. Wow. Got a lot of tubs and sheet metal parts. What is this? That is just... You know what? I need a scoop for my ramp charger. That'll work. This is a Dodge hood. I think a satellite Dodge hood. Or is it for this? No. It's... I think that's a satellite hood. But this one, I might be able to use that scoop. Oh, there. Another big block. Wow. I've am I'm got big blocks. Crazy. And another set of Pro Street Tour tires, tours. Another hood scoop. A couple more ugly center lines. I don't like that style of center line. Sorry. Am I even videoing half of this? A rear wing for a car. A rear spoiler. Just in case you uh, gonna fly away. Oh, here's the Chevy Two engine. The trunk for the Chevelle. So yeah, lots of little parts. Look at this. Big block valve covers? No, that's a... Oh, that's the Pontiac valve covers for the the other one. Good thing, good thing. I love Pontiac valve covers. Yeah. So all we, this kit I looked at, there's just whatever. Did I, did I go through this box? I'm not sure. I don't know what to do. Maybe we'll have a giveaway. Is it... Uh, our subscriber giveaway. Actually, you know what? Instead of giving this uh, subscriber giveaway, I was thinking of doing on the 500th subscriber, I would give that guy this kit. But I'm changing my mind up. I'm going to go uh, David Chin. He guessed the right color on the Super, Boo Super Bird unveiling. I can't get uh, speak again as usual. So I'm thinking I'll give this car to him. Or if he's not happy with this kit, I can pick one out of my small stash. I only got like maybe a dozen cars in my stash, so I'm pretty limited. Uh, except for this new batch, I got 10 more. So at this time I got, yeah, maybe 20, 25 kits. You know, at one time I had over 100 kits. And you know what? I'm not a f fan of this kit, actually. Except for I started thinking, what would this look like in black or a super, super dark blue? That might actually be not bad color to do this in. That might be cool. And you know, the funny part is, uh, Raul there at Muscle Car Modeler, he just did an unboxing of this kit. <laughs> uh, he just bought this kit and... Uh, did, did he open it? Yeah, he opened it. Now, I'm going to open this kit, and this one has been assembled. So, that's the other thing. It are all the parts and pieces in here. Actually, maybe I'm not going to open it because I can't video and do this at the same time. Okay, I have to do this again, kids. Sorry about that. Don't mind you while I shake you guys a little bit. Oh, for fudge seats. Only, you know what? 
Only when I'm on camera this happens. Uh, come on. This is why we're substandard leader in car model videos. So see, it's been assembled. It's got some dust. But everything looks there. Engine, tires. Actually, tires are kind of neat. Nice wide. But anyways, that's. Uh, I'll leave this option up to David Chin. Uh, yeah. I think you might want option number two for me to pick a kit. But it looks all complete-ish. Maybe. Yeah. Front end is there. Maybe not. I don't know. Maybe that's not a good idea, David. Maybe I'm better off keeping this for parts and pieces because... No, we got the A-arms there. Looks all there. Axle, yeah, I think so. Uh, anyways, yeah. So the unknown box. Let's go to the unknown box. I'm just rambling away, ain't I? Oh, my food's ready. I'm hungry. I haven't eaten all day. Hardly. Uh, okay, let's check this out. I can't remember if the 55 is here somewhere. I thought so. Okay, a lot of extra parts. Wow, look at that. Green Flames. 39 Chevy. I think somebody made a video of this. Who did that? Green Flames. Somebody did a video on Green Flames. If that's you, chime in. Because they really loved it. I thought it was Fred Henry. Maybe Fred Henry in the 39 Chevy. Maybe... That's a giveaway for him. Green Flames. I think he liked it. Because look at, there's this Chevy 39 Chevy cab, maybe. Wow, there's a lot of small stuff in here. Look at this. Tonal cover. Uh, vet hood. A couple of tuno, to, tuno? Tono covers. How do you pronounce it? Challenger hood. A lot of rims and tires. This, my friends is bonus time look at this bumper i don't know what that's off of looks like an um, chevy <coughs> <coughs> sorry chevelle here this was worth it here i'd pay 50 bucks for this that's a rare you don't see many of those <laughs> uh extra seats look at this extra seats extra rims extra tires fans oh my god exhaust uh, six back air cleaner. Crager. Unbelievable. More deco. Exhaust. Oh, sh Camaro. Hood for a Camaro. Chin spoiler. Another six pack. Wow. Am I even videoing this or just. There's headers, fender well headers, rad, more tires, Weber carb, wheel backings, this is coming handy, Weber setup, uh, what else, one more slick, I don't know if I'm matching anywhere, that's a tall one, wow, uh, that we went through already, so some interesting crap. Interesting cat. So, my friends. Oh, here's the other tall slick. Interesting. Interesting. What is this? Truck. It's for a truck. Cor Corvette. That's for a vet. Uh, this is interesting. Looks like IndyCar. What is that? That's a Chevy truck. I think, me thinks. Anyways, kids, another drag slick. Oh, or is that the same one? Anyways, exciting for me. Oh, there's the other. Yeah, I had two. One, two. A lot of small goodies here I've gotten. So that's okay. 50 bucks. It's worth it. Oh, it's, uh, what kind of room is that? Can't see. I need my glasses. That's a Nova style Camaro rim. Wonder if there's any more. Yeah, there's a couple different things. SS, Nova. There, second one. That might be interesting for something. Huh. Another vet style rim. 
A lot of good stuff. There's another one. So probably four, maybe, somewhere. Who knows? All extra. We'll sort through it at another time. But for now, my friends, here's another one. The Nova Stall. These, these always come in handy. If you're mixing and matching stuff. Wow, 12 minutes on this video already. Okay, enough guys. I'm blabbing too much. Thank you for listening to me. So there you go kids, ladies and gentlemen, children of all ages. That is a small 10 kit model car collection that we ended up picking up. A lot of parts and pieces that are going to be very valuable to the builds that I'm doing in the next little while. And one of them is the shop truck group build challenge that we're going to start doing the frame on the pro tour style that I want to do on this kit. So stay tuned for that next video. And you know what? Hey, yep, it's that time. Got to wake up anyways. What the hell? Cheers, my friends. We'll see you next time. Model on, keep building on. And you know what? I don't know what. Stay awesome, I guess. Cheers.